yes, I'm here. I'm sorry. I'm so excited of the Billis and Hunter's absolutely mind-blowing performance. Uh, first of all, let me say thank you, Mr. Billy, my brother, my friend, Billy Lamont, for your energetic live performance. It was just amazing. No words. Thank you. Thank you, sir. And Hunter, I'm shocked, like all of us. I hope so. Thank you for your kindness, gift, for your love, for your music, for your words and message. I'm David Duffy and this is what I'm doing. And I'm so honored to be here as a one of the builder of worldwide poetry bridges across the world, across the globe, across the universe. I think the literature actually has no borders, absolutely not. And love has no borders, because love is a language of all of us. So, cheers everybody, and let's get started. Thanks again, Billy and Hunter. I'm very impressed and so excited. Okay. It's called 12 Angels. I'd like to share with you some of my love poems. And especially this poem, The 12 Angels, was published by Wild River Review first time. And I perform this and next my poem, 21 Ritual Kisses, with Laura Anderson. Uh, in 2011. Then I recorded this uh, walk with rock band Sanda. You can find an internet, a Georgian version and English version too. Okay. <clears throat> the lilac angel bears the sign of my perfectness. And the angel said to me, you know death, the justice without love is cruelty. The indigo angel bears the sign of my freedom. And the angel said to me, the intelligence without love is craft. The blue angel bears the sign of my dreams. And the angel said to me, the authority without love is violence. The green angel bears the sign of my calmness. And the angel said to me, the dignity without love is arrogance. The yellow angel bears the sign of my faith. And the angel said to me, the wealth without love is self-interest. The orange angel bears the sign of my childhood. And the angel said to me, the upbringing without love is hypocrisy. The red angel bears the sign of my life. And the angel said to me, The belief without love is illusion. The white angel bears the sign of my speech. And the angel said to me, The truth without love it is fault finding the gray angel bears the sign of my death and the angel said to me the praising without love is man the city the black angel bears the sign of my mystery and the angel said to me without love you could not have been born david the colorless angel bears the sign of my spirit. And this transparent angel said to me, Love is the only thing to transform you and to make you feel your transfiguration today 
You know it better than we do. And here you are. The time has become endless. And here we are. Twelve. All around you. Thank you. It's pretty weird. <clears throat> read poetry online but it's so 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 fantastic drive i feel i can't feel energy across the world energy from new zealand new zealand from brooklyn because right now i'm on long island cheers hello from new new york long island and i'd like to share with you all my kisses 21 ritual kisses I kiss the mountain right in the sky. I kiss the rain right in the rainbow. I kiss the fire right in the ashes. I kiss the sea right in the shell. I kiss the forest right in the leaves. I kiss the night right in the star. I kiss the morning in its own mist. I kiss the afternoon in its own shadow. I kiss the time, right in the second. I kiss the past, in the memories. I kiss the future, in the presentment. I kiss the present, right here. I kiss the death, into the life. I kiss the life, into the love. I kiss the love, into the heart. I kiss the infinity right into the eternity i kissed all five senses music right in the sound miracle into the mystery i also kissed you right inside of me and the poetry and the silence with my word and my spirit a kiss for shadows a fairy tale i have to wait for your kiss the falling mountain cut the sky in half living the constellation creator genius is creating the universe when you appeared you protect roads and homes where we live by our fate and when i was about to kiss you you smiled like a mountain's mist with its fragrance in the valley and i felt beyond the dream that you also kissed me. Thank you. Thank you. It's a <clears throat> really great honor to be one of the builder of uh, worldwide poetry bridges with a beautiful, beautiful, absolutely new star, Hunter Beth, and uh, a, a super, super performer and poet. Mr. Billy Lamont. Now remember me. Standing on the edge of darkness, expecting calmness, in the deadly noise and fury of the sanctuary, do I not fear silence? Since I am under the same sentence of condemnation, and I indeed have been condemned justly, for I am getting what I deserve for my deeds. But silence has done nothing wrong. I am looking up. And when I look up to your naked beauty, dear air, and when I look at your strength, dear water, and when I look at your mercy, dear earth, and when I look at your holiness, Dear fire, I feel the presence of all the languages inside me, all around me. I feel they are the veins of the universe, where the spirit of the universe is the music itself, and the spirit of music is the melody itself. And the spirit of melody is the harmony itself. And the spirit of harmony is every sound of our heartbeats. As the world is breathing by silence only. Oh, 
divine silence, remember me when you come into your kingdom. Thank you. I hear your voice, by the way, how you are applauding me. I hear and I'm watching you. I know. Everybody, yeah. Cheers, my love to you. Thanks again, a beautiful audience. You're a fantastic audience, people. I can feel your energy right here, right now on Long Island, New York. And let me say a couple of words in my native Georgian. It means we will all get out of here alive. The message I said many years ago, and I wrote the poem about this, but someday something will be happened like this. I wrote this poem in English and in Georgian and then translated in English. But all of my stuff is written directly in English. And all this, these poems are forthcoming from, uh, in this year, to 2020, from Adelaide Books, New York, and from uh, Madhead Press, United States. Eastern Star. <clears throat> <laughs> What? <laughs> if there is no freedom within you, you won't inspire anyone. If a star is born only in the sky and not in you, you won't see the light. If heaven is not in you, you will never get there. If there is hell in you, you will never escape from there. If you are not forgiving, you will never breathe freely. If you don't give, you will never fly. If you lose hope, you will never wake up. If you don't steer your passion, you will never quench your yawning. You told me one day, I am your song, your breath is the song and the song is like me children are playing soon calmness will come i feel your breath in front of the gate you are the winyard's gate and this gate is the heart the heart is the choice the choice is the why you are what i think and always you are you are what i sow and always you were, so let me sing in your transparent breath. Be like the wine in your divine veins. I am wishing to let you hear the song as I am, and let me so please you. You know, I need this too. So far, so far, so near and so far. All the world's variations come down to one truth. And all the ideas come down to one breath. And all the world's secrets in your heart are revealed till the star of the East is the sign of the future. So near and not far, almighty and calm, Eastern star is trembling all over me and also all over you. We hear and we see the spirit of silence within our breath. Oh yes, which one we take and yes, which one we leave. Thank you. <clears throat> Thank you. And in all honesty, every word is alive. And we are alive as long as we understand one another, as long as we believe in one another. And if this huge dictionary of mankind will survive the following words, such as love, freedom, responsibility, hope then the world will also survive i think this is the mission of literature of poetry and, and my as a poet justification for existence 
The Lilac Shadow of a Tree, this is the Eastern Star, was the title poem of my forthcoming book by Adelaide Books, Eastern Star. And The Lilac Shadow of a Tree is also titled uh, uh, poem of my forthcoming book from Madhead Press. I am you, and who I see is me. If anything happens, it happens in me. It happens in you. I see the lilac shadow of a tree, and it seems to me that there may be times when you just have to love someone or people or a whole world from a distance. But distance means nothing when you loved one means everything. I only want to know what's going on between us, dear water. The distance between us is disappearing so fast I can't catch the second of sorrow, dear fire, the second of loneliness, dear earth, the second of joy, dear air. Everything is a second, but it's disappearing so quickly, without any trace. We're us, I know. And you are me, and I am you, and we are our sons and our daughters. We are our parents and oceans. We're winds and suns and mountains. But where is time? Time is distance, you told me. I know, and it's going, it's disappearing now, just because of knowing or love, just because of loneliness. I only want to know how it's possible to love you and stay alive. Stay alive and spend time for emptiness, for living without understanding your habits, dear earth, without understanding your calmness, dear water, without understanding your secrets, dear fire. Without understanding your speech, dear air. Distance means emptiness. When you loved one means the fullness of life. Yet I see the lilac shadow of a tree. Please speak to me, my author. I am the word in silence. Speak to me more and more and go and go. And if anyone will not welcome you or listen to your words, leave that home or town and shake the dust off your feet. <laughs> Thank you. And the final <clears throat> for today, because I think I have a couple of minutes. This is one of my uh, new uh, stuff of this pandemic madness. It's called Streets. This poem... I think this is the message, message for everybody, for all of us. Uh, this poem has been published by um, uh, Wild Sound uh, Festival for Poetry in Los Angeles and was performed by a professional actor, Alison <clears throat> Kampf. And then uh, it was also published in New York City here by Spillward Press and the day before yesterday it was included in the quarantine stories world edition and thank you for uh, for this amazing journey <clears throat> cheers again and let me perform and share with you my poem, Streets. Looking at the empty streets, beauty needs to be seen. I know you're happy out there on the other side of emptiness, yet the present is the choice which remains. In admiration, beauty. In poverty, wealth, and in silence, the sound.
I will put the gun down. Who stands beside me matters more. I'll remember the second on the other side of emptiness. I'll remember this present, but the streets will be alive again. Only that which needs to be seen will be. Because the best is yet to come. Thank you very much. <clears throat> See you later.